let's see another application of the concept of linear equation in one variable. We are told that the perimeter of a square is 64 centimeters. If the side of a square is two third of height of pencil, what is the height of pencil? Now this is a bit tricky and an interesting question. In this, what has happened is that I am told that the perimeter of a square is 64 centimeter. So we know that perimeter of square is equal to 4 into side of a square, which we are told that it is 64 centimeter. So 4 times the side is equal to 64 centimeter. Therefore, the side of the square has to be 64. I move it to the other side divided by 4 is equal to 16 centimeter. Now, what we are also told is that the height or rather the side of the square, which is 16 centimeter, is equal to two thirds of the height of a pencil. So let us say that the height of the pencil is equal to x. Now we know that x or the height of the pencil is x. Now we know that two third of the height of the pencil or 2 upon 3 into x is equal to the side of the square. Side of the square which we have found out in this equation. Right? Is equal to 16 centimeter. So what is the value of x? What is the height of the pencil? So x is equal to 16 into now, as we move these numbers to the other side, I told you that the denominator becomes the numerator and the numerator will become the denominator. This is through transposing. So this becomes 2 goes into 16 8 times or 24 centimeter. So the height of the pencil is basically 24 centimeter. If you want, you can solve it the, this equation the other way also. What you can do is that 2 by 3 into x is equal to 16. So you can multiply both the sides by 3 upon 2. Why 3 upon 2? Because 3 upon 2 will cancel out this and this, both of them. And then you can multiply this side by 3 upon 2. The result again will be the same which is 24 centimeter which we have calculated here. So this one application that we have used for linear equation.